Boom, 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 more eating. Grab your drinks, grab your treats. Boom, 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 say hi to Agnes. Welcome to Cowboy Playboy Steak Madness. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, like, subscribe, share me out, comment below, all that good stuff. Today, y'all, we are in for with another challenge, you guys. We... I have not been challenged, but I decided to take on the challenge. Um, Big Belly Bob and MRTV and Cowboy and Miss Shan all came together and collaborated on a Cowboy Playboy Steak Challenge. You are to get a Cowboy Steak, two pounds, two to three pounds. This one is damn near three pounds. Um, a baked potato and another side of your choice. And I've got mac and cheese over here. So... You don't have to eat it all. There is a $50 challenge of um, drawn. I think it's $50 or $100. I'm not sure. $50 or $100 for um, even participating. Okay. Miss Shan and Big Belly Bob, they finished theirs. MRTV Maria, she almost finished it, but she didn't finish it quite. And Cowboy, I think he finished the steak. I'm not quite sure about the size. I don't know. I don't know if he finished all his sides. But yeah. So we got a, a potato. Okay, let's get into this thing. And I got my chum sauce here, you guys. Link below if you guys would like to um, get a bottle of chum sauce. Also, don't forget to enter my giveaway for my birthday. I am giving away three lucky winners will receive chum dipping sauce as a um, gift for my birthday. So all you have to do on the last video, you have to comment, I love chum dipping sauce in the comments. That's the way that the random random uh, picker will pick the winner and also go over to my Instagram, more eats and um, put uh, at, chum, at chum dipping sauce, at chum dipping sauce at the company. When they, when you win, Go look at my video and you'll find out about the winner because it's almost my birthday, y'all. Hey, I was trying to let this thing rest a little bit. I like ranch on my um potato. I don't like um I don't like sour cream on my potatoes, y'all. I'm sorry. I like ranch. Mm -hmm. It got it got um. So what I did with my potato, I baked it and then I scooped out all the insides and I um. Made it a mashed potato, mashed potato field, and I put cheese on the outside. That one's on. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm. Yeah, I got some mac and cheese. Mm-hmm. Dang hot, y'all. I couldn't wait to eat. Okay. Let me put these sides to the side. Got my ice 57. Pour some of that. I had to get a few different flavors, y'all, because this is a lot of steak. And I, I need a few different flavors on that thing. Let me put these this first. Into this meat. And I don't eat no fat, so if there's some fat on that thing, don't expect me to eat that. I ain't eating it. Oh, yeah, this is perfect. It took me a minute to get it to the right way I like to eat it. I like my meat medium, but not runny. You know what I'm saying? Like medium to where it's still juicy, but not runny. Mmm, like butter, baby. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, it's gonna be sound good. Yeah. So, like I said, it's not a time challenge. You ain't gotta beast it. Oh my god, the season's so good. 
I should have bought my seasoner so y'all could see what I use for seasoning. Bottom mm, mm, mm. Steamy, baby. Oh, let me let y'all see my shirt. My son made a shirt for me. More eats. Like, subscribe. Boom, boom, boom. Look, look at my Agnes. Ain't she dope? Yes, girl. We ain't thought about selling them yet, but if y'all interested, you know, I wouldn't mind making a couple extra dollars. You feel me? <clears throat> Let me know. But we could for sure press them up. It's so good. It's so good. And I got, um, Open it? Shit. Uh-oh, y'all. I might have froze this thing shut. It was froze. The thing is... Oh, man. I'm going to be able to open it right now. Dang it. I don't want to stop the video because this is a challenge. Alright. People find clever ways. I don't know nobody to think. I stopped the video. And cut off some of that meat. Now people are, well, y'all ain't playing about these challenges. Y'all be serious. and shut on this damn thing. I'm like, really? That's what I get for going to five below and buying shit. I'm trying to be cheap. Oh, God. Damn. Uh, slippy lemonade. Put some uh, peach syrup in there. I made a peach lemonade. Cause I don't know what it is about California, but they don't be wanting to sell no peach flavor, nothing. If I want a peach Fanta, or I mean a peach crush, a uh, knee high peach, I gotta ask my family. All the way in Oklahoma. It's expensive to uh, ship sodas. They got more than forty dollars. You got no more forty dollars for it for shipping, please. I'm never paying forty five dollars to ship nothing unless it's something great. I almost bought these little things, these food things. I was watching Shark Tank. It was called Pizza Cupcakes. I almost bought them because they look, you know, like something different to do for the channel. Let's figure it out. $45 to ship them things. 
saying? Well, this is not a whole crab, sir. The heck? This is not a whole crab, sir. What do you mean? Just to ship it. Like, I could make some pizza cupcakes for $45. And I was just shipping. I didn't even... I think that thing came to like 20 some bucks. Are you crazy? It'd be funny about shipping, though. You'd be ready to buy a thousand dollars worth of stuff. That shipping come up to like $35. You'd be like, no, no, no. You start looking around, see if you can find some free shipping codes on it. I do that all the time. I Google, like, I Google discount codes. I Google discount codes because, shoot, I'm a, I'm a couponer by heart. I haven't couponed in a while. They still got a few restrictions on this stuff, but I'm always looking for the deal, okay? I'm always looking for the deal. Got one other bite. Got that, that one got the A1 on it. Let me still steaming. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna the top off of this. I better leave the top off of that, y'all. Cause uh yeah. And I'm actually hoping that the sound sounds good on this because I actually heard if you because right now I'm recording on my phone and not my GoPro so if I um I heard if you turn your phone around the other way not the camera facing you but you know the other way sound is much better although iPhones got some pretty good sound on their um, iPhones okay I'm starting to take baby bites I'm just kidding y'all been y'all tore y'all steaks up man y'all did good with y'all steaks NRTV and Cowboy they be having me dying over there when they hunt a cowboy down, she need to flash that across the uh, screen sometimes like it's a real phone number. Every time he says something, just have a phone number right there. When they hunt a cowboy down, <laughs> I'll be over here rolling. And he be over there just looking in the camera, chewing like just whatever. Y'all, it's funny as heck. Y'all funny. I'm telling y'all, this chum sauce is good on everything. Oh my gosh. I have I have made some spring rolls. Um, I didn't do as good on my spring roll, but they opened up this Vietnamese one, the one I got the fuck from on my last video, one of my last videos. Oh my god. They make some spring rolls that are out of this world. I'm going to have to do a whole spring roll. Or like egg roll, something crunchy. I haven't done an ASMR video. Them ASMR videos, I live in, um, in a townhouse. And I live right across the street from the park. So, I had to cut that fat off, y'all. I can't do the fat. It's too much fat, but y'all want the fat? Mm -mm. Can't do that. Um. Oh, excuse me. I live across the street from the park, and um, it's always some noise in the daytime. Like right now, I'm pretty, I'm pretty shocked. It's kind of quiet on the Saturday. Hopefully, I'll upload this on a Saturday. I'm going to be till Sunday, y'all. I don't know. I'm 
still learning my editing. Put this in. It's still big, y'all. Yeah. Sheesh. Got a nice little smoke ring in there. Look at that. I put it on the grill for a while and then finished it in the oven. I didn't want it to get uh, dry. Amen. Like a dry ass piece of meat. Because you know, the sauce right here that we use, the A1 and all that, that is just for extra. Honestly, a good piece of damn meat, you don't need no sauce on it, man. I mean, you don't need nothing. I'm saying my meat ain't good. I just like sauce. Let me get it. But yeah, you can have a good piece of barbecue. You don't need nothing. I haven't seen um, anyone else do the challenge. I should have looked it up and did my research. But it is a $50. I'm glad it ain't based on time because I'm glad it ain't a time challenge. But yeah. I'm already 16 minutes into this video and I ain't written them never one. I'm a little dog anyway. And wish y'all like y'all. I'm gonna do it. But I did want to challenge some people so the challenge can go keep going. I think we have until March 8th to um to submit your video. I don't know the rules, y'all. I think you just have to eat it and tag um, Big Belly Bob and MRTV. Ain't grabbing my laptop. Sorry. Um, um, tag them in it, Big Belly Bob and MRTV, so that way they can see it. And um, and yeah, it's not even a thing where you have to even finish. It's just like participate in a challenge and you'll be entered into a drawing. Um, let me go over here and, re and see the direction so I could tell them to y'all. I should have just put a video in here of Big Belly Bob doing it itself. I probably will. Guys, I am ready to get into this challenge. I'm going to briefly run it down real quick what the challenge entails. You must get a cowboy steak, a tomahawk steak, must be at least two to three pound size uh, whopper of a steak there. You must have a baked potato. Does not have to be loaded with all the goodness that we have, but why wouldn't you want a loaded baked potato? You got a side. I got corn because I love corn as much as I love eggs and a few other items. All right, so corn's one of my favorite items. Got some of that. You don't have to necessarily finish the meal, but we want to see how much you can eat. The thing is, can you eat it all, guys and ladies? If you can do that and just attempt to eat it on the 8th of March, that's when the contest ends, we're going to end up picking a random winner on a live, you know, on our channels or somehow we'll work it out till we both do it. And we're going to pay out $50 to a lucky winner of the Cowboy Playboy Steak Challenge. I couldn't wait to eat this steak. I had it marinating for a day and just like a, a seasoning. And... Mmm. And they're reasonable too. It wasn't like a fifty dollar steak, like twenty five dollars, twenty six dollars, or something like that. That's a lot of steak. And honestly, this steak can feed more than one person. Like, I mean, I know some people it's just like one person can dominate this whole day. You know, this steak is meant for a couple folks. It's not made for just one person. Oh, heck no. Let me move my laptop for real. No mishaps. Okay. But yeah, I did want to challenge a few people to do this challenge. You know, get some good eating on. Let me put that piece of meat over here. Get that bone. I ain't got no dogs. I ain't got no dogs. 
Mmm, so juicy. A little crunchy ends be good. They be good. What's this? It's a lot of meat. I'm actually doing really good. But I'm glad today that you gotta finish this challenge challenge because I ain't gonna be able to finish that. It was good though. I'm gonna be tearing that up later. I'm about to watch that new movie on um, HBO Max in a little bit. I'm gonna climb right in my bed after this watch. I'm do whatever I need to do to edit this thing in my bed. Shoot. Nobody here. I was quiet. I ain't really got nothing to do today. Chill Axe, y'all, is the name of the game today. Chill Axe. Mm. Because mm -mm -mm. you can't do that in California anyway. See, everything closed down still. Everything's still closed. Don't forget to enter the contest for a giveaway. Three lucky winners gonna win two bottles of the chum dipping sauce. Hot, I mean a spicy and an extra spicy. And honestly, it says spicy, but it's not like overpowering heat spicy. The extra spicy got more a lot kick to it, but the other one, it's not really spicy. You know, if you don't like no kick to nothing, then you might not like it. If you don't like nothing with a kick to it. You might not. But did I tell y'all how I made these potatoes? I just scooped out all the potato. Mashed it up with some butter and garlic. And put all the potato back into the skin. The mashed potato. Back into the skin. Put some bacon. Ranch, that's all I like on my potato. I know everybody likes chives and sour cream. You can put so many things on a baked potato, though. I was watching Smoking and Grilling with AB. That's where I got the idea. But he put he put uh, rotisserie chicken or brisket or something on top of his. Rotisserie chicken, I think it was. Mm -hmm. Have y'all ever checked him out? He got some good recipes over there. I done made a couple of his recipes. Yes, he just hit a million too. I think he's local to me too. Yeah. That. I'm gonna need a serious toothpick after this. I'm gonna need a serious toothpick, okay? Mm. I wanna challenge some people to this challenge. I had to look around. I don't know who else did it, but I looked at Big Belly Bob and MRTB's list and these people were not on it so you guys are now on the list tea time more aj dc mukbang oh excuse me stay and play 71 explore the wagners living life with lisa lisa and tk both of y'all or tk usually do the challenges but it's not a time challenge so real ralph and mika boo um, let's throw out some big ones. Steph and Tasha and Dame Drops. Um, let's see if y'all can beat this. There is a $50 cash prize in it. Um, always if you win money and you don't really need money and you do win a prize, there's always ways well, you can donate your money to local charities. 
and so much stuff going on to local families, buy somebody some groceries. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. Somebody some gift cards to the grocery store. That's twenty dollars. Can go a long way in the grocery store when you ain't got nothing to eat and no means to get anything. So, you guys, I'm really full. This is what I got left. This big inner piece and then this, which is mostly fat. Um, but I will be seeing where the meat is at because I ain't throwing away no meat. Okay. All right, y'all. So, I did the challenge. I think I did it. Don't forget, if I challenge you, don't forget to tag Big Belly Bob and MRTV in the challenge. This is their dual collab. Thank you guys for coming into my channel. Say bye to Agnes. Thanks for coming to my Cowboy Playboy Challenge Madness. So, uh, the challenge is to get a cowboy steak and have at least, what, one or two sides? Two, two sides. sides. Two sides. Yeah, we put our broccoli with our baked potato. So you pick your two sides. It's no time limit, anything like that. You just have to eat what's on your plate. Okay, so mm, that's that. Eat what's on your plate and see where you go. <laughs> Money time, baby. <laughs> All right, man. If y'all are not excited about this like we are, and I'm sure MRTV, Maria, and Cowboy uh, are just as excited as we are to try to tackle the Cowboy Playboy Steak Challenge. That's a big, big one. Oh yeah, that's what she said. <laughs> so remember, all you gotta do is do the challenge. Make sure you put the co-creators, MRTV and Big Belly Bob in the title. Share us out, like, whatever you gotta do, but make sure that you do this challenge. I don't know, I'm lost, I'm ready to eat this steak, so I'm gonna shut up. Boom, 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 more eating. Grab your drinks, grab your treats. Boom, 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 say hi to Agnes.